Various leaders have remembered Mama Mukami Kimathi, widow to Field Marshal Dedan Kimathi, who died last evening at the age of 96 as a patriot who promoted peace and fought for the good of the nation. Her family is, however, saddened by her demise, stating that her last wish to be buried beside her late husband failed to come true. Here's NTV's Ruth Sarmui with more. March Easter celebrations 2023 was the last holiday Mama Mukami Kimathi would spend at her rural home in Jambini, Nyandarwa County, where she joined other faithful at the Faith Christian Fellowship Church. Hivyo ulikuwa unamuona, akona miaka migi, ata macho unaona hawezi kufungua. Lakini alikuwa anaimba wibo ikamalizika. Alikuwa nataka ya muhimu sana, mkae kwa amani. Mama Mukami was forced to move to Nairobi after her health deteriorated, leaving behind her home that she inherited from the colonialists. Her family now wants the government to refurbish the dilapidated houses and gazette them as a heritage site. Tunataka hii jina ya shushu ya Mukami Kimali isiwahi kusaulika mama alikuwa anapigania uhuru sasa hii inaonyesha mahali msugu alikuwa anakaa nyumba ile imekaa miaka mingi sana na haijabomoka sasa ingekuwa wanakuja kusomea historia pale ikuwe kama museum Mukami's death before realizing her last wish, which was to find the remains of her late husband, Field Marshal Deban Kimathi, has come as a blow to this family who now say they will continue with the search in honor of the late heroine. Sasa kilio cha mama, alikuwa nauliza, bona, sitaki kukufa, ama loho yagu yede pahali, kabla sijazika buwana yagu kwa hali ya heshima. Ameshipua karimu mama kamburi ishirini na yote haizai matunda. Yote inaonekana siye. Sasa tunafikiria hawa wazugu wali muzika. Banda ya kumuzika mushana uzikuwa karundi. Wakashukua mwiri siji wali pereka wapi. President William Ruto and his predecessor Uhuru Kenyatta joined other Kenyans in paying tribute to Mama Mukami, describing her as a patriot and a peace crusader. He has been the symbol of our defiance to oppression. She has been the mother of our liberation struggle. Ruth Sarmoy, NTV, Njambini, Nyandarwa County.